Okay, so here's the new language uh, to, to teach you about the uh, smart port uh, uh, digital transformation. Uh, so far, it's also belong to a very high industry. Listen. So, I'd like to show what it means uh, digital transformation. We call it digital transformation. So, if you because the list is belong to high issue, so if you like, it's interesting to do your research, it would be easy to accept by the journal, so you can try. Okay, so how, how? Okay, let's show you the, some uh, agenda, including what is the digitalization transformation. So, what is called Okay, so, uh, digitalization in maritime physics. And what is the digitalization in my this? And uh, how number three driver for digitalization transformation in maritime shipping. Key success factor of digitalization transformation. Okay, so uh, and also you have that you know just uh, one coin to sign. Okay, one coin to sign. So you could you could buy a mean like you how you find. Okay, very to digitalization transformation industry. You know. Every time you use a new one or an advanced, uh, I mean, so, uh, uh, advanced uh, new thing, right? So sometimes you find out that all men cannot accept this kind of uh, new idea. So it's not good for to complement. Okay? Okay, I know that. Okay, what's means? Uh, we use a digitalization, uh, of course, they can modify what? You know, basically process. Yeah. This process lets me make it more easy. For example, you know, in school, every time I make some application, quite 20 years before, we sh we have to fill in the I mean the I mean the school the document, and the upload to get a permission by my hand of a department and hand of a president, right? So you step by step, you know, you just ask some guy at our school assistant to to take our our document paper to the to the office, you know, and the one by one, different rankings, famous nine, and sometimes find out our document will be lost, will be stolen by some guy we don't know. So that's why our school right now, if you make any application, can use your, we say, uh, we say the uh, system that's been the uh, documents uh, examination system. So you can make an application by your platform. Very easy, convenient so far. You don't need to go to the, I mean, the, uh, or some uh, some department say I would like to make a application about my my school leave. Okay, right now can use your platform to do anything. Very easy. Use your mobile phone. Okay, that's why we so colder can save your time. Of course, will change your culture because very convenient. So change your culture. And also because COVID-19 teach up, we have to keep some social distance with people for our safety, for our security. Yeah, so we change our business process culture and the customer on their experience. Okay, APR user, I have studied, uh, I mean, I have interned in APR before. When I, uh, I'm a university student, I use some time to go to APR to, to get training. They have ecosystem, I have to know that. And uh, because they use a system to manage uh, their own people, their different culture, all the world. Okay, so uh, for example, I'll give you an example. Okay, so uh, I'd like to share the our bio ladies, okay? Because in listen, EPO is a very, uh, and also a very interesting issue in listen, okay? Uh, let me show first one is uh, walking through. How to make a uh, I mean, so, uh, deal, okay? Okay, first one, set a buyer will sign a contract, we say the uh, international trade contracts. And because they have, uh, in the contract, they have a different term. Okay, it's so a different term. For example, uh, for example, Gaussian port, Gaussian port, and uh, 2020, for example, and uh, it's, uh, you know, and of course, they are by C4, C20. Okay, so according to these uh, contracts, because uh, you know they are issued uh, on the LC, and uh, 
And uh, she, she had five hours watch the carrier, she and company. We served on a carrier, carrier. And uh, she had cooking there in space. Professor, yeah? may I ask? In this particular case, sir, um, the contract between the seller and the buyer yep. already includes the seller um, that the seller will be the one to contract a shipping company to ship the yes the sometimes goods. sometimes yeah but uh, sometimes sometimes also um, it would depend on if the buyer would like to choose his own shipper no depend on your trade terms <laughs> ah yes trade terms okay yes. I, I show you very basic two uh, two trade terms uh, you know FOB right yes yes. Okay, they have to buy this break and share it, okay? So, sell. Okay, so here is uh, here is the ship. Free on board. Free, that means uh, free of duty. Free on ship of duty, on board. Yeah, that means on board, okay? So that means in here, you say FOB. So how about this? It's a it's red color. Mm -hmm. It's represent the seller's very specific, yeah. right? How about this sign? Because they have some C. Uh, this is a belongs to buyer mm -hmm. Okay. So because uh, it mentioned about the um, about I mean sir. Okay. You just mentioned about ship, right? Mm -hmm. Who older? Who named this ship, right? Okay, because this belongs to we say C transport, C transport. So for the seller, there is responsibility on the just to deliver, deliver to the on board mm -hmm. is finished. So how about this ship? Who who catch buyer? So let's be careful. The uh, buyer have right to order because right buyer have to pay one, pay, pay this one. We say free conference of a C transport break. So she has a right to order which three uh, companies, okay? Okay, order, okay? So free on board, very easy. Okay, she has let me cost plus the uh, insurance plus break. So that means uh, their breaks is intention to like this, insurance to like this. Okay, here it's, I would say, ocean break. Here is uh, we say uh, marine insurance. Okay, how about this? This because it belongs to transport. So so yeah. Sarah sit only on the to this line. Yeah. Okay, so no change. So may I ask you who have right to order the ship? The seller. Of course, yes. because uh, should the seller the cover seller this pays uh, the ocean freight uh, right? right? for the insurance. Yeah, pay this one and pay this one. We open the price. So, if uh, FOB, yes, you have the right. Okay, here is uh, FOB. So, that's me, depend on the trade Okay, continue. Continue here. She has to follow their uh, Mr. contract to booking their uh, space, right? So for example, this space to array, so booking space. And in the uh, uh, shoe company, they have a system with a booking or system. Okay, the booking, your cargo will be to the array. And uh, how many container? Uh, one, I mean, so 40 inch, 40 inch one, okay? And also, they will give you some, if you so call the, uh, we say the shoe but the semi order is, uh, you know, in granted. Brand that means just an application form only. No any words inside, character inside. In granted. In break, right? And then you have to go to, uh, go back, bring this uh, paper to go to your battery to fill in your, 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 your information inside. So, next time you can already fill in. 
and uh, bring your cargo here, and then deliver to Shim County, and we order some terminal, some terminal. Uh, and so, did you deliver? Uh, I mean, so your Shim order and uh, I mean, so your cargo to Shim County, and on board date on board, on board right? And they were issued with a uh, year. So, quite a long time ago, I mean 20 or 30 years before, the beer always document. Document has me a lot. Because uh, when you open the big sign, big sign the, they will show the um, beer or some clothes, some regulation, big sign. But right now, because it become the erratic, uh, erratic document, so uh, if you need to file their this company, their um, law or regulation is that to, to the bill lady. You can go to their website, they will show you. Okay, so very easy. And, and, of course, because, uh, uh, because uh, this bill is not only to have related to the shipper and the buyer, and also related to the bank. bank. Okay. Okay. So I'll show you. For example, for example, uh, they have some, uh, you know, in the contract. We just show you a threaten. For example, threaten is FOP. Okay. Number two, shipment term not on Um, the demo pay port. Just a pay port. Also, thank you. Number three, we say the payment term. Payment term, for example, we use your uh, uh, currency. Okay, data currency. Okay, so for the buyer, he's a uh, so called um, African. He has another job that means African. This one we say consenting, but we say the um, benefit. And uh, they have some, we say, the, or we say the issue bank. Of course, they have issue bank. Okay, so issue, uh, I mean, so apply for, apply for uh, LC issue. So, LC come here. Here, first one, we say advising bank. Okay, so let me RC arrival notice. Okay, so she prepared, prepared the document, right? So she will present. We say present to uh, our financial documents and uh, then the sheet document of that. Because uh, tra they have to present the trade document to I mean, so to pay, the bank will carry money to them. Shipping company, including the bill lady, commercial invoice, certificate original, and other. This one we say draft. Sometimes they say bill, bill change, bill bill. Return, function, and function. Here's I need to make sure. Here we just mentioned about the lady here, okay? So when you present, when you present a, a trade document, you pay money to the seller. <laughs> this one too. I mean, sir, beer, we just show beer only, okay? Beer about nothing, okay? So trying to pay money. Okay, may I ask you, because uh, you're a major in accounting, right? <laughs> For issue bank, right? For each bank. So she already paid money to the uh, uh, minister. Uh, this one may be paying payment company. She paid money to the uh, already paid money to the uh, uh, minister payment bank. Let's represent what account receivable or account payable. Which one? Yep. 
because because here the the bank uh, becomes the conduit for the payment. Yes. Yeah. Uh, so that's why the money coming from the buyer going to the issuing bank would be account receivable, and from the issuing bank to the payment bank, it would be accounts payable. Ah, uh, yes, 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 of course. Because uh, we pay money in, yes. in the mess. Yeah. In the mess. Yes. Of course, of course, the payment bank already pay money to the super. Yes. So, she support he has pay money to him, right? Yeah. And then, of course, they have uh, got money back from the buyer. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Okay. So, do you know what's mean trade off? Because he should pay, for example, for example, this payment turns the uh, money is uh, for example you started. Okay, ten thousand you started because uh, already paid to someone, right? For his accounting, okay, I pay someone already ten thousand, but I need to get the pay. Uh, I mean, repayment from the buyer, right? Buyer. So in my account, in my account will be trail because for his account, you understand? Yeah. yeah, you pay the money to to the shop, right? I pay money to you. So in your account, it's a uh, it becomes zero yeah. because uh, this is a company, right? So the shipping company, for example, transport on a golf shop. Okay, because uh, you pay money, so we get got a fee of lady. Okay, so uh, so we, we take a fee of lady to the shipping company. The shipping company will give him some, uh, we say, the delivery order because he uh, uh, use a. Just uh, I a mean, car to transport your cargo to the warehouse operator, and then you take the new order, and you you take back your cargo. Okay. So let me show you the white uh, document and uh, I mean the so bill lading there working from. Okay. Bill bill here. So how about the, your cargo? Your cargo here. Finish. So if some if next time you make a low shoe, low shoe right? Be, between the seller and buyer, you just draw this chart. Okay, bro, you can finish any question. Very simple.